and it's pretty similar in the other counties too. The county commission can put it on the ballot through a vote of the county commissioners. The, uh, you can do it by citizens initiative, which is what Sherry was talking about, getting a certain number of signed petitions. Or you can go through what's called the Charter Review Commission. And in Orange County, that meets every four years. So in Orange County, that's what we decided to do. And we proposed uh, this WeBOR charter amendment in Orange County back in June. And uh, as, as I told the commission at the last meeting on Wednesday, I, I'm a man, so I don't know what giving birth is like, but this has got to be pretty close to it. <laughs> it was excruciating. Uh, but, uh, okay, it's close to it, I say that. <laughs> uh, to, to give birth to this idea in a local community, when you're talking to people who look at you as though, you know, you've got horns coming out of your head, it's like, what are you talking about? And we started it, and then uh, it got a little publicity, and then we started getting the opposition. And the highly paid lobbyists sitting in on meetings, uh, contacting the individual committee members. Uh, but through it all, we have uh, persevered, and in the audience today, I'd like to recognize him. Uh, we have Eugene Staccardo, back in the back of the red shirt. <laughs> Eugene chaired the subcommittee that uh, gave birth to WeBoard. And I'm pleased to report uh, on Wednesday of this week, the full commission voted and it passed its first vote. It's gonna pass two votes before it gets on the ballot. It passed its first reading by a vote of seven to five. <laughs> so we have, we have one more vote that will happen uh, on March 4th. And then uh, uh, it's headed straight for the ballot. It doesn't have to go through the county commission. They don't have to approve it. It just goes straight to the supervisor of election to be on the November 3rd ballot in 2020. So with that, I'd like to turn it over to Mark Katie with KISS 4. This has to do with the Kissimmee River Bill of Rights.